Hello, how are we all doing? Now it's time for me to say something that'll get me banned from Twitch. Um, right, so, I have to share this with someone because I feel like Jessica shared this bit of information with me earlier. Um, it is something I could have done with not knowing, but apparently there's a subreddit called Goon Caves where guys just post pictures of, like, kind of offices they've made with multiple monitors that they just straight up watch porn on 24-7. It's really fucking weird. It was the weirdest thing to to have a look at. It was horrible. Don't go on the subreddit. It is absolutely fucking cursed. It ruined my day. Um, you know, I was able to blissfully go through to Edinburgh this morning, uh, getting a really cool haircut, which is fantastic. I came back and then they got absolutely ruined. Um, so no, don't go and check out that subreddit. Um, and yeah, so Jessica, obviously, the all she does is post pictures of my office. Um, <laughs> no, I'm joking. Uh, yeah, frequent frequent flyer of um, of goon caves is is Jessica. <laughs> Sorry. Anyway, uh, before we get in today, I noticed that a ton of you have left since. Um, <laughs> the If you want to check the link directly above, I'll cut that bit out, this, this sponsor message. But you'll notice that uh, we're being sponsored by Proteinworks. Uh, there's a link in chat. Uh, you should check it out. Um, I got a kind of care package sent by them. I've been um, using the... Um, what the fuck is it called? I've been using their kind of loaded lunch bars. I've been using the spread. Um, I, I got like a kind of protein peanut butter spread and that's pretty, pretty good. Um, so I would recommend it if you're looking for kind of protein snacky things, check out the link in uh, in chat and we will go from there. Anyway, today we are going to be continuing with Crow Country. Um, the last time we played was slightly difficult because I kept on dying. Um, I have since gone and um, fixed it, so we are back to um, where we should be. Um, I went and did the mushroom thing and then I went and got the mask, so we are all kind of up to date on that side. Uh, we're going to jump back in and we are currently on our way to the maze. Um, don't know how the button on my controller will do. Hopefully it'll allow me to at least get through today. Um, I haven't really checked it, but it's, yeah. Uh, someone very kindly on Tumblr mentioned uh, that they might help me out on Ko-Fi for it, but I'm not holding out on that. But, um, yeah, a replacement would be handy. Um, anyway, we're going to jump through on this side. Uh, we are... Oh, fuck. Okay, we're gonna run through... I have been poisoned, and I can't open... Oh, fuck's sake. First thing, and I can't open my fucking inventory. This is hell. Uh, I will... Chuck the woeful mask in there. While I... I'm in here. What I might do, actually, just to make my life slightly easier. So the controls, if I am using my, can I, hold on. Sorry, I'm gonna see if I can try and use this with keyboard and mouse. And uh, nope, it looks like the moment, uh, oh no, there we go. Inventory is X. Uh, so is there a way to, like, quickly switch, do you think? L, X, then inventory, and then I can plug my controller back in. And, okay, so that'll, <laughs> that'll be the way I play, um, for now at least. Uh, we are... Last thing was a bit of an issue. I don't know if we we shoot them first, maybe? Because we got killed by one of them falling on us uh, last time. So we can do that, which is cool. We will flick these. 
Because uh, I think there's ammo and stuff that we can collect. There's a med kit. Always useful. I'm not sure if I've played any of the uh, the other games that um, the uh, Crow Country devs have played. I should check them out, though. Okay, so we'll grab the shotgun shells there. We will then make that turn into an eye. We will then run round here, where we will get the... I'm not entirely sure what the deal is here, actually. Okay, so... We need that to be there. We'll then run round here. We'll make this into a swirl. Tangle Tower. I don't think I've... Oh, fuck. I don't think I've played that, no. Okay, we'll shoot that down. We are then going for the pentagram. Or... No, we're not going for the pen. No, we are going for the pentagram, just so we can get that stuff. Collect all the things. Some handgun ammo. And... We will then run through here. It is a... A bottle with... Is that gas? I think it's gas. Yeah, it is. Okay. Nice. Looks like a witch's cauldron. It's full of murky water. It smells really bad. Let's dive right in. It's weirdly warm. Reach in further. I can feel something at the bottom. Let's grab it. Oh, a trident. Nice. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. This is worse. Being trapped in a maze like this. Oh, that's a child. Oh, no. Oh, no. There's so many enemies here. No, we're out. We're gone. We're gone. <laughs> Do not like that music. We are skedaddling. Right, next up we are... Oh, that's new. That guy's a new bad guy. Stabbed myself on the way through there. Oh, was able to get there. Nice. What the fuck, Pingu? Pingu just sprayed gas at me. We will take that antidote. <laughs> no, no, motherfucker. Cursed. Ah, shit. Oh, I don't like that random traps are spawning. I, like, I get the, um... Ah, fuck. Okay, hold on. Oh, no. Come on. Oh, I don't like this little thing. Fuck. 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 Whew. Not a fan of that guy. Fuck that guy. Hello. Natalie, my daughter, she's here, isn't she? Yeah, sorry, this is something we saw last time and I didn't do. Uh, I told her not to, I thought I'd convinced her not to. Listen, can you get her out of here, get her to leave now? Mr. Crow, she got hurt, she was attacked. I see. Hmm, not very good. Now... I think because I've got the trident I can do that now. 
That is very cursed. Oh, I need to like sync them up. Oh, what is happening? Is there a way to... Oh. There we go. Nice. It's a small silver key. We did it. Sick. Okay, now that we've got the silver key, we can take on the world. Still don't know how to open this door. But <laughs> it's locked, but the sign says it's open. Alright, I'm looking at the back of the sign. I'm kind of dumb, honestly. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, because we've got the silver key, I think we can do... No! No! Oh, Jesus fuck, no. There's too many things spawning, I don't like it. Let's get some healing. Right, so. Set the arcade game scores. Dolphin score should be twice the mermaid score. Boat score should be twice the dolphin score. Shark score should be twice the boat score. Okay. I don't know what... So the shark shooter... Oh, aim and shoot the fish, don't scoot. Okay. Their skulls. That's another skull. So is this, uh, this is kind of dependent on my skill then. Okay, so I can finish that at any time. Dolphin, so... Shark score should be twice the boat score. Boat score should be twice the dolphin score. Dolphin score should be twice the mermaid score. So there's... Mermaid quiz? Oh, fuck. How many countries are there in Europe? Good question. Thirty. Nah, it's thirty-two, I think. What caused the extinction of the dinosaurs? It was a volcanic eruption, I guess. Was the approximate population of Earth? I think we're at seven billion now. Wait, we're not at seven billion? Oh fuck, nineteen ninety. Shit. Um. It's like, what was the tallest building in the world then? World Trade Center? Nah. Empire State, probably. I'm not good at general knowledge in the 90s. I'll be E.T. or Jaws, I think. What kinds of food should you eat the most of each day? Fruits and vegetables. Oh, fuck off. So, dolphin score should be twice the mermaid score. Let's see what the dolphin dash is. Jump to pop the balloons. But I can just finish the game at any time, so... So all we need to do is get one mermaid question, right? Fuck knows, man. I mean... Just the tip? Okay, finish the game, that's one. 
So the mermaid score is one, so the dolphin score is two. So the boat score needs to be four. And the shark score needs to be eight. That's fine. Okay. And then speedboat will need to be four. Okay, so that's four, and now we can just shoot one shark. That's a skull. That's also a skull. That's fish. Nice. Something in the coin slot, a data disk. Yes. Finally, we can go and use all the computers. That's handy. Okay, so we are first going, I think, the train room. I think that's how this works. So, oh god, there's so many little bastards. Oh, fuck. Come on. Nice. What was that? That is a large med kit. Okay. Oh my god, there's so many things. I mean, obviously they're getting a little bit more cursed each time. Oh god, there's two of those. Hold on. That is a silver key door. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! Absolutely fucking not. That'll do it. Okay, and there we go. Nice. It's an action figure. It's a little plastic crow with fairy wings. Check the price. $4.25. Oh, no. I'm going to have to do maths. This is a disaster. Gifts for Natalie. Haunted Hilltop stuffed toy. Classic crow country rubber doll. Fairy tale town action figure. Let me know the total. I'll pay you back. I'm a little- I'm a little mushroom boy. I'll use my mushroom magic to grant you a wish. Tell me what is it that you wish. What's that? You want to improve the capacity of your shotgun? To each their own, I guess. Sure. Nice. So... Any- I mean... I don't see why that would be the case, but do we need to then add... Haunted Hilltop stuff toy, classic crow country... Rubber doll and the fairy tale town action figure. It's a plastic crow with a golden trident. Okay, so we will go with a cheeky wee 495. We will then find the rubber crow doll, which is 10, so obviously we're 1495. And what was the other one? Fairy Tale Town action figure. Haunted Hilltop. Nah, maybe it's the Haunted Hilltop. Rubber Crow. Rubber Crow with a pumpkin head. It's a stuffed crow. Is that it? No, it'll be the Haunted Hilltop, so it'll be the one with the pumpkin head, which is 550. What's it? 20... 45? No, that can't be right. Fuck. Uh, 
Ah, I got that wrong. It was the Fairy Tale Town action figure, which I think, yeah. Fuck. Sorry, go again. Four twenty-five plus ten. Because I think. Classic Cruel Country, which I'm guessing is this. Yeah, because the other ones. Pumpkin Head. Yeah. And I have just managed to guess myself. Fantastic. It's just 1975. Okay. I don't know if this will be remotely correct. Hey, it is. Oh shit, I got a magnum. And it's a secret. Fucking sick. Watch out. Fuckers. Everyone's at risk now. Think this is where one of the computers are? Yeah, there we go. Ah, shite. I don't know what any of that did. Engine, first car, second car, caboose. I, I don't understand. Computer systems in both the railway room and the dungeon now need security disk access. Yes, I know it's inconvenient. These are the new regulations. Do I need to match up? What's... Orion's Odyssey, it says there, which I think is this one. Oh, I need to determine which one's which, so I'm guessing... Engine will be A, and... Caboose will be the caboose. I don't know what the first car is. So that was 1934, that was 1927. So... I'm confused. So, are we trying, uh, like, are we trying to do the order? Just notice there's handgun ammo in that train. Um, so you've got the engine being the first one. And that was blue, so that's 1927, then it's this one. What do the numbers correspond to? Yeah, the Orion's a combination of the others. So, we've got the Duke of Farnham in 1927, which had the engine and the blue one. 
Then you had... Ah, wait, hold on. Wait, so you've got Arabella and Delilah design styles. You've then got the Arabella and Bernadette design styles. So... So that's A and then D? Yeah, so A, D. And then B and then C? Maybe? <laughs> So that's Arabella and Delilah. So A and D. You've then got Arabella and Bernadette, which is So that's the common one. So the engine is E. You've then got D. You've then got B, and that must be C. Why is this not letting me do anything? Anyone have any idea? I'm, I'm open to I'm open to suggestions now. I would have thought I'd cracked it there, but. Either way, I'm going to save it just now, just in case. Doesn't really say anything about the... I mean, this is like a kind of safe room, but... Do I maybe need to do it the other way? No, because it doesn't matter. Oh, I'm very confused. That to me is it. Is there a is there like a lever or a anything? Hmm. Okay. I'll maybe come back here, I guess. I think it's, like, the weird thing about it is that it's, like, an additional bit of puzzle without being, like, it's, it's hard to know what else to do with that. If there was something in that room that was, like, a glaringly being missed, I would maybe get it, but. Okay, grenades. And... No! No, he's gonna fucking ah oh, shit. Ah, oh, that's really annoying. What a waste of a grenade! Ow! Maxi, come on. Okay. I'll just press X on my computer. Right, we'll try the data disk here. Oh, for fuck's sake, prisoner. What prisoner? Prisoner legs, arms, heads and eyes. Uh, 
okay, maybe it's like numbers total, so... Two arms for the mermaid. Four legs for the wolf. Okay, so we've got four arms so far. Okay, so I think, yeah, we'll go with four arms. Then eyes will have... Snake will have two, mermaid will have... Oh fuck, is this to open up them individually? Ah, okay, two legs, zero, heads, one, eyes, two. Yeah, it is. Okay, fuck's sake. Right. Well, we got some acids. It's always fun. And an antidote. Okay. Next up. One head, no arms. More antidote, that's fine. Uh, one eye, one head, two arms, two legs. We'll get us into the Cyclops room. Grab some shotgun stuff. Grab some medkit stuff. And then a snake. Has no legs, no arms, one head, and two eyes. There you go. Don't say that I don't teach you anything, eh? <laughs> okay, cool. We were able to grab all that. We also got the acid bottle. The acid bottle is good for something. Uh, we know that Crow's office requires a gold key, which we don't have. I think there's a silver key in a bunch of the submarine bits. So we'll head back there, I guess. That was a good puzzle. Uh, like a puzzle that also wasn't frustrating to solve. <laughs> I still don't know what to do about the other one. It's probably for like a really special secret, but I haven't found that yet. Right, these little bastards are going down. And then I'm gonna lure this guy in. Come on. Nice. Let's see. So that won't budge at all. That doesn't even allow me to use a key. Oh. Just been attacked. Hey, right. There's this room. That's a golden keyhole. And that is not budging. Shit. Where was the room... Ah. So we'll go back in here the arcade, which is a funky area. Uh, oh, there's a giant bastard here, isn't there? Yep. Ah, fuck, 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 fuck. Okay, shotgun is out. Kind of hoping I can, like, collect these guys. Come on. Okay. Nice. Silver keyhole, sweet. Two one zero six. I'm still not sure about the whole zero. Oh god. Oh god. Mara, oh hello, sorry for barging in. I should introduce myself. I'm Mara Forest. I'm looking for... I like the purple. What is that? Dyed? Oh no. Must be. Doesn't look like a wig. When you're finished talking about my hair, I think I might need your help. I'm looking for Edward Crow. Yeah, I bet you are. 
You must be Tolman. I must be. What was it Marvin said? You were the root excavation guy? Correct. What's root excavation? No idea. <laughs> you know, you're not being very helpful. Correct. What a bastard. The park is closed. Duh, I know. So go home. I can't go home. Sure you could. Just get in your little car and drive away. I'm sure that guy you saved would appreciate it. Arthur, you know about him? At least he had the good sense to get injured once and give up. Tolman, what are the monsters? The monsters? Don't pretend like you don't know what I'm talking about. No, it's just... Trust me, Mara, you don't want to know. Can I turn on the elevators from in here? The elevators are broken. No, they're not. They're just pretending to be broken. So where's the switch? Let's see if you can work it out on your own. What a bastard. Is that a music note? That is. It's an electrical grid with four little lights. The lights are all red. Ah, shite. Hold on, what note is that? That's just a fucking hang, isn't it? Nah, that's rubbish. Um, 1350, 1912, 1937, 1945? Tolman's records, March 21st, 1989. Guests are appearing almost every day now. We can't save them, they're too far gone. But I want to know where they've come from. I found a number, marked it in blood on the ground, 2106. It's not a code for any of our locks. It's not a code at all. Great. Thanks. <laughs> Sounds horribly distorted because the aerial's been cut in half. Hmm. I'll take that antidote. Oh god, right. A Litany in Time of Plague by Thomas Nash. Rich men trust not in wealth, gold cannot buy you health. Physic himself must fade, all things to end are made. The plague full swift goes by, I am sick, I must die. Great. How easily man's grandest ambitions are undone. The iceberg was first spotted on the cold moonless night that was April 14th, 1912. They say it could have been avoided, were it not for man's inclination for hubris, panic and blunder. And there was the Hindenburg. A small fire broke out on the port side just ahead of the port fin. One witness on the starboard side reported another fire behind the rudder. That was it. <laughs> and Hiroshima. Look up as you are passed over by the heavy shadow of the B-29 bomber. In an instant, it is lighter. Oh, that said E on the screen there. Oh, there's been letters this entire time and I've just not been reading them. It's released 10,000 pounds of cargo. Okay, so we know that the last one's E. Let's go back to 1350. F, okay. F, A. F, A, C, E. Face. Great. Hooray. Face. Nice. I solved your stupid puzzle. Be honest. You loved it. It was quite good. Cool, so now all the elevators are Mara, hold up. What is it? Don't go down there. You'll regret it. So be it. So obviously we can go down now. Not sure how I feel about this, but... Nothing bad will be happening under the 
Oh, fucking Jesus. Okay, no. Oh, that's a lot of guests. We'll put our service to the test. Looks like they have gold inside. We'll take some shotgun shells for sure. Notice board, I can't remember the code for the break room security gate. I swear I had a three, a six, a two, and another six. Can't remember the order. I know I took the code from an old license plate, but it's gone missing. Ah, shit. Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. Oh, I hate it so much. That was cursed. 2663. Atlanta Falcons. There we go. Good thing this didn't melt. Oh, that's the way to get out. Gotcha. Oh, did not like that. Shout myself. Okay, let's see. Okay, we're fine. We're fine, we're fine. Two, six, six, three. Nice. Okay, yeah. Is that a... I don't know what that is. Northeast? It's a lever. Mm. Perish. Tolman's records, 1988. I finally turned off the excavation machines. Boss didn't give me permission, but didn't argue. He's obsessed with the pool and the guests. He hasn't answered his phone in days. There was an accident in the park. Boss had to shut the place down. I don't think he cares at all. Oh, fuck. A large tank. Acid is steadily dripping out the pipe. The smell is almost unbearable. Maybe I could use some of that acid. Sure. Let's fill up the acid bottle. What is the acid for? Do we know? There's a sign, Calibration Route 06, Friday, Loving and Giving. Kind of makes me think there should be something else here. Maybe not just now. We'll continue on. Let's crawl through this pipe. I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay. Oh, it's this fucker. Harrison, what are you doing? It's not safe down here, you know. Y yeah no, I know. I got chased by some kind of creature, I think. Did it touch you? Did it? No, no, I got away just about. I ran in here to hide to get out the way, you know? Right, good idea. And there's this big gas vent, and I thought, okay, maybe I can be of use, maybe I can turn this off. Yeah, how's that going? Bad, I don't know how to do it. I tried, but it's too complicated. I don't get it. Hey, it's okay, I'm sure you can do it. I'll help you out, okay? I swear to God, if we just need to pull this lever. Thick, smelly fumes are flowing out of it. The lever doesn't want to use. Total gas pressure must be exactly 50 for successful manual override. Okay. The screen is cracked. Oh, no. Oh, so we can't tell what the... Great. I mean, I'm, if this is just maths... Ah, uh, maths. Okay, 
Okay, we're on 27 there. Uh, we can go for 38 and 12. Are they? Fucking maths! Check that out. Hey, you did it! Yep. You're pretty smart, huh? I sure am. And so modest. That was some pretty speedy maths, actually. I'm impressed with myself. The display changed. Hmm, let's not just press this. Nah, shit. Come on. I have a fucking hell. I've now got slight, uh, like, what do they call it? There's, it's drift. I've got drift on the fucking aiming button. Okay, so that's another. Oh! Fuck. Reloading and blam, blam. Blam and blam. Yeah, it's really is. I think a lot of controllers just do that over time, but it's fucking annoying. Cool, so I can now save, which is a very good idea considering I've done quite a bit. It's a map of the underground area. There we go, now we're talking. Warning, I shouldn't have to say this, but for your safety... Alright, oh, okay, this is just a hints thing. There's a sign. So that's Wednesday, I'm guessing. But, not really found... It's interesting that it keeps on giving you the hints all the way throughout the game. Oh fuck, go away. Oh, great! That was just... an explosive. Fantastic. So, yeah, injured. No shit. Okay. That's a great sound to hear, you know? Oh, fuck. This fucking guy. Oh, God, it's the worst. Come on. Shit. No, come on. Oofed. So that's Route Tuesday. What kind of machine is this anyway? Maybe I could turn it on and see what it does. Sure. Oh, that was underwhelming. Maybe if there was something between the clamps. Face, uh, ID card, gemstone. Nah. Well, we need to find something else, I think. That was handgun ammo. That's the lift up. That's a thing. That's really hard to get the camera angle right. There we go. Come on, drift. Do your thing. For fuck's sake. That's Route Monday. That's more handgun ammo? Cool. So I think we only have one more kind of section to check out. Or maybe we've done all four now. Oh no, we haven't, because that fucking thing was there. Oop. Nice.
some kind of generator. It looks ancient. Let's just turn it off. I have no idea how to turn it off. It looks fragile. Maybe I can just destroy it. That'll be the electricity, won't it? For the door. Handwritten letter. Hey Ed, did you get my rock shipment? Why don't you answer the phone? What's going on over there? He's dead. Med kit. Calibration route one, Sunday preserve for posterity. Ooh. Still not quite getting what this is. Ah, is. some healing. We'll take the grenade. Ow. It's a wooden model. The top layer looks like it's supposed to be grass. Bottom layer looks like it's soil or rocks. Okay. That is a grenade. Jump back in here. Yeah, I still have no idea what the fuck that stuff is. Okay, I think I'm gonna maybe go back up. So northeast is where Natalie Crow is. I believe. Oh god, is she not there any she's not there anymore. Fantastic. Okay, so there's something still in the theater, which I've not done. So I'm gonna go and check that out. What have we not done in the theater? Oh, there was like the weird water thing, wasn't there? Oh god, have they respawned? Oh, they fucking have. Those little bastards. What if we poured acid in here? And then melted the fairy. The acid has no effect on the wooden fairy's head. Maybe there's something else I need to do first. Is that a bomb? That's a bomb. She's facing the other way. Please varnish the ocean. Hmm. Maintenance, please varnish the Ocean Kingdom storage room door. Oh, maybe I can melt that away with acid and get into the storage room that way? Ah, fuck! No, run, you bastards! So... We can go this way. Hey, True Wolf! Thanks very much for the follow- Oh, fuck! Oh, I don't like these guys. Right, we're running in here. <laughs> Thanks very much for the follow. Hope you're having a great day. <laughs> Sorry, that was a moment of panic. Check my thing. There we go. I'm gonna save. I don't like it's ticking up how many times I've saved. Is that good? I don't think we've got a keypad there. Nothing. 
The guests are getting worse. They're getting really creepy. Have we been in there? We have. Um. Oh god, there's so many. There's so much 2106 writing. That's creepy. Oh, I mean, we're gonna have to. Fuck. Sick. Sick. Nothing but net. No. Ah, fuck. I was kind of hoping that I would get something from this. <laughs> like the text changes, but I'm not sure if it's. Yeah, maybe this is just a little bit of fun. Okay, where to now? Right, we're gonna try and melt that door. He says normally. Oh, wait, what? That is the... Fuck's sake. Oh wait, I turned off the gas so I can get in here. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. He can't be turned, but having the horizon stretching out in front of me is a nice feeling. It's a treasure chest. It's fake, it doesn't open. <laughs> wait, what was that? It's fake, it doesn't open. I'm feeling a very tangible sense of betrayal. a med kit. Nice. Okay, it seems like... Oh, no. Oh, God, I guess we have to go in. This is fun, but I can't operate the raid controls from here. Huh. Oh, God, that ringing's annoying as fuck. Hmm. So, where's the... Control room requires the golden keyhole. Oh, when do we open that? Seriously, when do we open that? I noticed there's an elevator behind the large crow. Does it go anywhere? Does anyone use it? It's always seemed to be powered down. I figured it was broken, but someone said there's a switch in the crow's office that turns it on. Hmm. Oh, fuck. No. What's that? It's a large med kit. I don't like this. Bronze key, crank handle, ruby chain, mask trident, silver key, data disc, acid bottle fill, golden key, large battery, what an ordeal. <laughs> that just straight up tells you how to finish the game. At least the order that we've kind of set. What the fuck? It's a bunch of flickering numbers, I can't make sense of it. Okay. Small tank of gasoline. Can I, like, shoot this down? Fuck. Smells bad and it's giving me a headache. Hmm. I'm enjoying those fumes, leave me alone. Hmm. Okay. Okay. 
It's a vent. Is there something inside? I like to live on the edge by running round this fucking thing. Banana peel. There's oil there. Huh. Golden key. I like that it looks like the crows kind of leave behind. Maybe it's the crows that deposit all of the, the goodies for us to steal. I'm gonna run, like, to the car just to see what's going on. Maybe something new. We've not seen that guy in a while. No! I hate it. Don't like that thing. Are you done? Can we leave? No, sorry. Why? What are you doing? I have to find Edward Crow, the owner. Okay, we've seen this. Anything else in the trunk of the car? Oh, apparently enough handgun ammo. Oh, this record. Ah, fucking yes. What have we got? A shoebox to Natalie. Happy 17th, Dad. Running shoes. Oh, sick. Can we... Oh, whoa. Okay, we move a lot faster now. We got the zoomies. Oh, fuck. Oh, I don't like how many of them there are. Right, I need some health, I think. Yep, I'm injured. I'm now no longer injured. So... Hmm... I might actually use one of my clues. Oh, fuck! Nine credits remaining, yes. The golden key is hidden in the head of a fairy. Okay, we do kind of know that. But how do we get into it? It says we have to do something for it first, and then it said something about... The door? Ah, hold on. Do we... Okay, so that is full of acid. So, keep on poisoning myself. Electrocution machine. Okay, so let's... Let's head southeast. I kind of like how this feel. There's like it, the map feels big-ish, not to the point where it's like, oh, you don't know where anything is. It's quite quite nice in that sense. I am finding a lot of shotgun ammo recently. Right, we'll head southeast. We'll go into that room and we'll see what's going on. Because it was this room, I think. What needs a bit of... Do I have anything that needs a little bit of electricity? No? Hmm. Not sure whether to use another clue or not. <laughs> so 
to. Let's just see. Oh, sorry, one, three second. We'll we'll save it here again, just in case. We've got funky shoes now. Let's go. Sake. I thought that was Magnum ammo. <laughs> right, let's see. Uh, where are we? Where are we? Is there anything down here? I remember there was that creepy thing, but I wasn't sure if there was anything else in this room. There was a gate here. Ophelia. Yeah, nah, we're out here. Actually. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, cool. Sure. We'll take that. I'm guessing you're talking about Bonnie Prince Charlie, who was an arsehole, and I do agree. Frick. Just wanted to be the king of Britain. Oh, God, fuck. Yep, we'll crawl through here. Run through here. Fuck's sake. Ah. Wait, have we been... Yeah, we have been in here. Okay. Hmm. Any anyone with any ideas? Santiago, what what is happening? <laughs> Fuck. There are dozens of us. Doesn't. Jacob Jacobite music? What do you mean by Jacobite music? I'm curious. How uh, So apparently she's an acid resistant fairy. Maybe there's something else you need to do first. I mean, yeah? Uh-huh. Uh, yeah, yes. We, we, yeah. Can someone from maintenance please varnish the Ocean Kingdom storage room door? It's made from really old wood. Starting to crumble. It's not exactly fire safe. Which kind of implies that I need to set the fairy on fire, but I don't think we've got anything to do that. And we can't use Nightem on her, so... I am curious. What's well, got the, uh, the interest on Scottish history, Santiago? Right, so the theatre we can't do jack shit with. The Seven Seas, we can't get into the thing. Can I blast the door with a grenade? Nah. 
Look at that. That's a good shout. Yeah, I'll give that a go. Yeah, it was Bonnie Prince Charlie's fault. He refused to um, attack London. <laughs> and in doing so, he doomed us. Give them more than enough time to get themselves together. What the fuck? It makes me think that I need, like, access to this room must be important for some, I mean, unless it's purely using that, but can I, like, shoot over the top of it? No, because it, it needs the key. Oh god, sorry, I can't listen to that phone ring and not be able to fucking get it, it's really annoying. <laughs> At least we're running around a little bit faster now, which is good. Tons. I think I might have to go for another one of those hints, which I believe is in the sunken treasures. Give me another hint. The golden key's hidden in the head of the fairy. You have eight ki- yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake, was I just supposed to shoot the fairy's head? That's not funny. I suppose I should have thought of just, like, shooting it. Oh, God. Get wrecked. Okay, clear this. I hate those ones. Those ones are fucked. <laughs> it's like weird goo with like a child's face. Kind of like a, a cartoony kid. Is that the... that's the gold key, isn't it? Well, that was really fucking cursed, actually. <laughs> but we've managed to do it. Yay! It's done. I don't feel very good about it. That was a little bit strange. I'm gonna go to the crow room, although I'm anxious that... It'll take me to, like, a bit that I... Oh god, that is a big boy right there. Hopefully it's, this isn't, like, end game going into this room or anything. I don't think it is. It's a box of shotgun shells. That is a lot of medicine, holy shit. <laughs> you know, I never had a plan for all the gold. In fact, it quickly became a problem. We couldn't sell it, basically, not without arousing a lot of unwanted attention. We had too much of it too quickly, and the shape, those cylinders, well, it's not the normal process, is it? Then I had an idea. What if it was the normal process? Or what if we pretended it was? So Marvin and I devised the plan. We just needed a site, a disused gold mine. Marv found one in South America, in Brazil. And you know what? It worked. For a while, at least. Oh, so they were sending the gold down there to be like mined something strange about the frame oh no no don't dislike there are so many medkits I already took one I'll leave the rest other people might need what the fuck are you talking about I think the gold is from underneath Crow Country theme park. And it is being mined and sucked up and they were like, oh shit, we can't just say we've got struck gold underneath our theme park. 
we need to send it to a gold mine in Brazil, I think. Maybe. Emory University, in recognition of completion of the Proceed course of study, Edward L. Crow has been admitted to the degree of biochemistry. Hey Ed, we didn't pass the inspection, they figured out that the ore is homemade. Brazilian authorities want to know where the gold is really coming from. This is getting too dangerous, I'm coming back to Georgia, see you soon. No unauthorised entry, nice. Control room elevator, switch number code, my first is in Grinner, but also in Goblin. My second is in Guest, but not in Puddle or Spindle. What? Is a number code, but is also... What? It's not like letters. My first is in Grinner, but not in Goblin. But also in Goblin, so it's either an I or a G or an N. My second is in Guest, but not in Puddle or Spindle. So what the T? What? My third is in Lumber and Goblin, but not in Puddle. Hey, yeah. Lumber and Goblin. So you've got B. My fourth is notable only by its absence. What the fuck does that mean? So... G, I, or N, T, B, what the fuck? Just <laughs> confusion. Looks like Arthur's still inside. Talk to him. Arthur, can you hear me? Mara, is that you? I can't see you. Where are you? I'm in a control room. A control room? Is it cool? Yeah, it's really cool. I'm jealous. You got to go on a real adventure. Arthur, how are you feeling? Not great. Just stay there, okay? Mara, are you coming back? Are we gonna leave? Say yes. Sure, yeah, I'll be back soon. Okay, good. He was never seen again. It's a video feed from a security camera showing something on the screen. It's moving. Hello? What are you? What do you want? Didn't respond. Banana peel? Oh man. 623541? There's a button underneath it. Oh, what? Okay, little bit confused. Right. Oh, wait, hold on. Ah, oh, right, okay. These are- oh fuck, okay, they're the different types of thing. The number switch code, first is in Grinner, but also in Goblin. It's okay, Grinner and Goblin, let's check. Emerged at around 55% root excavation, despite their small stature, I've concluded they're not infants, on the contrary, they may be a senior variant of the guests, their advanced age causing a weaker genetic makeup.
Grinner and Goblin. I mean, it's seventy percent. My first is in Grinner, but also in Goblin. So for what? Five, five, nine, two. One, seven, three, nine. So nine. Okay. My second is in Guest, but not in Puddle or Spindle. Three seven six two. Ah, oh, fuck! I'm gonna have to write this down. <laughs> I'm writing this down. Right, three seven six two. Three seven six two. Six four one three. Oh, there's puddle there. Three, nine, seven, three. So it's in the first one, so we can remove... It's two. So nine, two. Okay, everyone bear with me here. Third is in lumber and goblin, but not in puddle. So puddle is three, nine, seven, three. Lumber is one three four seven half ah, fuck me. Sorry, this is <laughs> Right. So puddle is three seven three nine seven three. Right. You've then got Ah fuck, sorry. Tried. Lumber and Goblin, but not in Puddle. So Puddle is 3793. Three. Goblin is 1739. And Lumber. Yes, yeah, 1. It's eight. Nine two one eight, I believe. Fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Ah, fuck! No! Ah, shit. Set floor panel code to one, two, three, four, five. Ah, frick. How did I do that? Ah, okay. Hold on. Okay, so. One. Two. Three, four, five, six. Ready, nice. Okay, well, that was, uh, yeah, first. Small notebook The Diary of Edward Crow, age ten and a half. Saturday, I am excited. Tomorrow, Father and I are going camping up in Condor Country, across the river, over the river. Father says it's just a nickname as there are no condors in Georgia. I'm looking forward to the trip nonetheless. I love being outdoors at night. Sunday, Father and I found something strange while camping. A green shiny thing sticking out the ground. It's wriggling back and forth like a little bug. But Father says it's not a bug, it is made of metal. We found a second wriggling metal thing a couple hundred feet south of the first one. Father wanted to know what it was made of, he cut off the tip with his camping knife, 
Inside is a different metal, it looks like gold. Two more shiny things, four in total. Father says there may be more. Father bought Condor Country, as well as a couple of acres on either side. Said we could rename it if we wish. Okay. Campfire, I will definitely be saving. And then this is the wriggling thing. Squirming back and forth, is it alive? Don't really know what to do with this. Oh, fuck! Hi, Nally! <laughs> How are you feeling? Not great. <laughs> yeah, me neither. <laughs> is it your mother? Yes. She died some time ago. I'm sorry. It's a beautiful statue. It's a s solid gold. Yeah, it must have been very expensive. Your dad really spared no expense, I guess. Did you find him yet? Mr. Crow? No, not yet. Oh, okay then. I'm still looking for your father, but I have a pretty good idea where he is. I just need to take the central elevator. Mara, what are you going to do when you find him? I need to talk with him. Are you going to kill him? What? No, of course not. Don't think I don't see that gun in your hand. I see it in your face too. You've already made up your mind. Natalie! I know he's done bad things, very bad things. Perhaps he's beyond forgiveness, but please don't kill him. Bring him to me, okay? Let me speak to him. One way or another, today, today might be my last chance. Please, Mara. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Didn't know that that was our intent to just straight up murder him, but... Oh, I don't like that guy. I'm just trying to think of the best way to go here. I think I'm going to go this way. Because I want to go to the the sea world, deep sea world. Because we've got the gold key now, we can do what we want. Meow. It is a lot faster traversing this area with the bunny shoes. Oh. Right, we're in here. What we don't have is a battery yet. Like the battery for the crow at the front. I think we're round here. Round here. And then... This way, because we can open this door. With the gold key. Boom. Hop on in. Oh, we'll answer that fucking phone. Hello, you're still alive. I know it's dangerous up there. A lot of them got out into the open. I know you brought a gun. Have you been killing them, the guests? They're in no shape to continue living. The ones that emerged more recently, even more so. As I continued the root excavation, the guests became even less. Well, some of them aren't even bipedal anymore. It goes without saying that we cannot let them leave Crow Country. We cannot afford to let them infect anyone else. What are they? Who are they? They're irreversible. Okay. They did say that the mermaid area in the Sierra uses the same kind, but as Yeah, I think that's the one there, is it not? That we used. I think. Oh, come on, let me... Can... Cool, we'll grab that grenade. This must be how you operate the boat ride. I don't see the point in moving the boat if I'm not in it. I can't reach the control panel while I'm sitting on the boat. I think I might need some help with this one. Oh, interesting. Okay. Sure. In that case, we'll go in here. I think there was a lift in here, if I remember. Maybe not. Ah! No. Okay. So... Oh no, there is one in the garage. Yeah. There we go. I still don't know what I need to electrify. 
Unless it's to... Ah, oh, it's how you charge the battery, isn't it? That's what it'll be. It'll be how you charge the battery. Just cracked something, stars. I ask because I certainly haven't. Okay, you're gonna save it again. I do feel like maybe using up a hint, another one. There'll be an achievement for like doing it with no hints, eh? I too am confused. So, we need to find a battery, and I imagine the battery, when we do find it, will be dead, and then we have to charge it at the thing, and then we pop it into the crow at the front, but I don't know where the battery is. Let's go and check in here. Let's hear it. The battery's hidden inside a mermaid. What? Inside a mermaid? Where the fuck is the mermaid? Is it in here? That would make no sense, right? Okay. It's inside the mermaid. think of a way to open it. So, is the mermaid in the... I was thinking in the ride. New donation from Tumblr friend. Oh, thank you so much, Tumblr friend. If you're watching the stream now, now seriously, thank you very much. Um, it doesn't give me any more detail about it, apart from just saying uh, that someone's been kind on Ko-Fi, so thank you. Oh, God! Is the mermaid in here? Oh, no, there's gas there. Did that seriously not hit because the table was there? Fuck's sake. What's the deal with the... the soda? Hmm... What is the deal here? Ah, wait, hold on. Fruit and friends, so we've got... Berry, lime, pineapple and strawberry? Or grape, sorry. Ah, haha! -ha. 
Mr. Crow keeps extra treasure maps in the wooden bureau in his lounge. The code is 8891. Hmm. We still don't know the fucking code for that door. Is it the factory default or something? Oh god, okay. Fuck's sake. <laughs> there we go. Oh! No. Right, 8891. Oh, sick. Map of secrets. Okay, so there's like a whole bunch of secrets. Hmm. <sighs> right, so... The battery is inside a mermaid. But I need help. To... With, with the mermaid thing. Did it not say that? I'm gonna, I'm gonna fucking ask the stupid crow. Use the treasure chests to access the merm- what the fuck? Use the treasure chests? To access the mermaids? It's fun, can't operate the controls. Is it by any chance warm in Scotland? Yes, it is, Janica. It's absolutely roasting. But I'm at least very warm. I'm always warm just normally, but when it gets warm in Scotland, it's fucking warm. I just got poisoned. Right. Wait, am I still poisoned? I'm going to try one more time. Oh, right, okay, it's not even telling me that now. A little bit confused. There's nobody I can call. It's a hat. I think I might need some help with this. I mean... Sure, we'll go and find... Well, we'll go and speak to the guy in the... the car, I'm guessing. I'll just run. Shit. Oh, fucking hell, that the jack shit. Arthur, did a police officer come by here? Yeah, he was on a bike. Did you talk to him? Yeah, a little bit. Do I have enough handgun ammo? I don't fucking think I do. Oh wait, no, I want my speedy shoes back on. What? Hmm. Ah! Okay, fuck this. 
out of there. <laughs> okay, I'm fine. Maybe the lady who was doing the whole the, the lawyer lady? I'm going to speak to her. Oh god, child. So she was down in this cell. Oh no, she's not down in this cell. What the fuck? Let's see. I feel like I'm getting quite short on ammo now, which is entirely my own fault, but... Right, I'll go back down here and see... No, wait, I need to go back down the left and see where that cop ended up. Uh, yeah, I'm getting low on pretty much everything. You're right. I should have saved. There is a save point somewhere down here though. Yeah, it's just on the left there. No, northeast. I'll go to the save point. Right, I'll just check in here first. So that's the electrician, yeah, electrician bit. Electrocution bit? That one wee bit. We'll hop in here. And we will hop out. Hop in here. So we will save. Just to be careful. I've realised that the running shoes make a squeaky noise now, and that wasn't great. Right, let's go in here. The, the cop's somewhere down here, at least it was. Right, we sorted this whole gas section. Hey, Shadow Kane, thanks so much for the follow. Hope you're having a good day. Right, we'll go northwest. On the bright side, we have killed everything down here. Which is useful. So we've got the acid tank, that's all fine. We'd read that book. I ran into that fucking hook because I'm an idiot. Break room? We've been in the break room. We've kind of explored all this, haven't we? Yeah, we did. Hmm. Is there something really obvious that I'm missing? Because, like, we don't have a battery. So we can't really do anything. The battery's in the mermaid's head, which is in the the ride. But we haven't found the cop, like, lingering. No secrets down here, apparently. In fact, the cop's moved on, because he was in the, um... He was in that room. Hmm. Right, what do we think? Back up? I feel like it's kind of got to be. So... We dropped to 10 and lots of rain. Ah, oh, I'm so jealous. <laughs> Incredibly jealous of 10 degrees and rain. 
Why don't you come with me? No. I don't want to know what's down there. I'll wait here. Ah. Uh, why? I don't know. I do not know where the cop is. Can I maybe give instructions to Arthur from here? Can you hear me? Mara, is that you? Control room. Nah, nothing. Okay. Um. What I'll do is I'll head. I'll I'll just head around that area, and hopefully he makes an appearance. What I'm going to do actually is I'm going to go down and then I'm going to go long one because that'll be a shortcut. So we are going to the northwest. Northwest up here. There we go. Nice. Here, jump up there. I'm guessing the map doesn't tell you where the NPCs are, right? Tolman's. Ah, uh, it could be Tolman, maybe. Oh, for fuck's sake! Where are all of these bastards? <laughs> Right. So through here. Maybe in the submarine? Cop was at one of the slicey machines. Yeah, he was. Um, and we went and checked and is no longer there. So I'm surprised that they haven't just kind of like turned up because I can't imagine the NPCs would actually like walk with you or anything like that. There is footsteps going that way. Maybe it's that. Or were they always there? Oh great, now we can open it. Who the fuck is this? Hey kids, Julie, what happened? I'll tell you if you help me out this thing. Oh right, hold on, that's the lawyer, right? Strange. Thanks for the help. How did you end up in the crate? Some guy grabbed me from behind and threw me in here. Some guy, who was it? No idea, I didn't see his face. He had real sweaty hands though. Oh gross. Yeah, not an especially enjoyable experience, all told. I wonder if it was Marvin. He looked like he'd be kind of sweaty. Marvin who? Oh nothing, don't worry, just thinking out loud. I'm just glad you're safe. Yeah, listen, that's twice you've helped me out now. Let me know if there's any way I can return the favour. Right, thanks, will do. Anything I can do for you? Ask for help. Actually, there is something. I need to get through the boat ride in the Ocean Kingdom area. The Seven Seas? Yeah, I could use your help. Have you opened the door into the control room? Yeah, it's open. Nice work. I'll head to the control room and you go to the boat boarding area. See you there. Cool. Very strange that we couldn't just do that before toured the entire map until then. Uh, but at least we've got the... We'll get the battery now. All aboard. I like how she's put the hat on. Are you ready to go? Yes, I think so. Can't guarantee that this will be safe. Should I start the ride? Yes. It was a little bit. Especially because it didn't give me the option to do that before. The um, ah, fuck. The white whale's blocking the boat. If I remember right, he's supposed to move out of the way, but I think it's done manually from the control panel. Wonder why Julie didn't press the button. Because Julie's gone. Probably. That's a bomb. That's not good. I can't have a bomb. And I cannot change... Ah, for fuck's sake.
Okay. Can't go through that way. Okay. I have no idea what's going on here, but it looks like I control the mermaids. Biggest, most ornate switch I've ever seen. Okay, so I can go back through here. And there's blood on it, and it seems to have stopped. Oh, fuck. Did I just get Julie, like, killed? Because that's not good. I hate the sound this makes. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what the whale spouting does. It is a PS1 styled a survival horror game. Uh, it's kind of got influences from things like Silent Hill. Um, and it is very good. I've been enjoying it a lot. So I've noticed that whale does its little blow thing to the last I... Oh, oh! To the last I grapple with thee, from hell's heart I stab at thee, for hate's sake I spit my last breath at thee. What? The last one in the row? From hell's heart? That's from, okay. Anyone who's read Moby Dick know what's going on? Oh, wait a minute. What if I just need to fucking shoot them? And just... Like... Uh, it's nope, that is not what you do. Oh my god, really? <sighs> right, okay. Fuck's sake. Okay, that's so much easier now. Wait, hold on. What was that? There's a battery in here, it's totally fried, okay. Okay, try her. Is that a battery? No, it's a case of shotgun shells. Excellent. <coughs> Sorry. Okay. Battery? Nice. Righty, folks, I think, and I, the thing is, is that I kind of know that this won't take too long to finish, unless it has a, quite an intense endgame. 
Uh, but I am probably going to have to wrap up soon. Uh, so I'm going to go back to the lounge and save my game. Um, and I will be heading off. So let me just go and do that. But anyway, thanks very much for joining. Uh, really appreciate you all turning out. I know that uh, it's not what we normally do on a Friday. Um, we're normally playing Minecraft, but uh, it allowed me to get through some of this. I think that's maybe uh, a, a good thing. It allowed me to actually finish up some games on stream. Uh, but yeah, thanks very much for turning out. I will chuck on my end screen uh, just now. Um, feel free to check out some of the links. Obviously, join the Discord if you're not in there. Uh, we've also got uh, a, a wish list that you can check out. Uh, you can support me on Ko-Fi. And there is also a link to YouTube. I aim to do a little bit more on the YouTube front this weekend. I know I've been letting that slip a little bit. Um, so I will try and get back to uh, doing that. But uh, yeah, thanks very much, folks. And I will see you next time. Uh, goodbye. Have a great weekend.